So I thought about this on my way back, you know, when I go out and make these videos, whew, I don't, uh, I don't record much video on the way back, of course, because you already saw what I saw, and this is what I'm calling my first uh, motorcycle chat. So, you know, just kind of want to throw out some, some ideas, things you might want to think about them. I'm still on Twitter before they banned me at uh, that, that CyberSec, SEC guy, uh, on Twitter.com. Uh, mainly, I just talk about personal cybersecurity, which, uh, you know, one I'll throw out there, and I'll probably put a post up on that, is uh, Proton Mail. Just found out Project Veritas is on uh, Proton Mail. Twitter's not too happy <laughs> with Project Veritas today, because they just came out with news that Twitter's working to ban a lot more people on Twitter, so they're going to be taken down. If you uh, if you supported the MAGA movement in any way, shape, or fashion, I imagine you ain't going to be around on Twitter very long. So. Uh, and I, you know, I feel your frustration. I was up on Parlor, and uh, a lot of people they said, "Well, you know, what's the big deal? You know, that's a right-wing, you know, site. I, you know, so what if 15 million people lost the ability to communicate? Well, these are dark times. We're heading down. I've never seen censorship take place like this ever. I mean, people being taken down off of YouTube, and who knows? Maybe I'll be taken down. I got my Rumble account, so if they take me down off of YouTube, I got all the videos stored and back up and. I'll just, I got a few posted on Rumble right now, and I'll just post some more. I'm, I'm that cybersecurity guy on Rumble. And uh, so, uh, but where are we headed? I mean, it looks like the uh, Green New Deal is going to get some major traction, good or bad. You know, I'll throw out, you know, the, the left, uh, the left radicals or the left wing or the Democrats, they want everybody to wear a mask. Well, that's become an environmental catastrophe. Those masks are in the ocean. Uh, I see them everywhere I go, even in remote areas like this, I see masks all over the ground. It's, it's, a, it's a littered nightmare. Uh, and who wants to pick them up? So, you know, somebody might have had the virus breathing into that mask, you know. So it's just going to get worse. So there's one that, you know, they're talking about. Now here's one that, that the right is against. Uh, just, just take banned straws. I'm just going out on a limb. There's nothing wrong with banned straws. You don't need a damn straw to drink your stupid drink. That's just a plastic a uh, piece of garbage that doesn't need to exist just you know sip off the side of the glass unless you're worried the glass isn't sanitary and then drinking out the straw ain't going to help you anyway i'm just doing some stuff so where are we heading with the green new deal they're going to be really leaning down on fossil fuels uh the fracking industry they're going to cease to exist in my opinion and i uh, and it's not a bad idea we do need to get off of fossil fuels but the problem is the technologies that we got with solar panels and wind panels let me get a drink <clears throat> They, they create their own garbage nightmare. And, uh, you know, at nighttime, you, you've got to have those, those huge batteries. And uh, we're using a lot of fossil fuels to build those solar panels and build all of the green technology. And um, so it's, a, it's almost like the no-win scenario in Star Trek. You know, there's good and bad in every way you turn. You know, we, we're never going to be able to do without fossil fuels, but you can start winging yourself off of them. And this is an example. This is my Honda ADV because I, I really expect gas prices to uh, go way up, way up here under the Biden administration. And uh, so you're going to want uh, transportation. I'm getting 100 miles to the gallon here. So if it does hit five, ten, ten dollars a gallon, you know I can I can still. It's going to cost me money with even at 100 miles to the gallon, but it's not going to be that bad. And uh, you know, like I I watch a lot of YouTube. Um, you know, Mike Maloney. He's the guy I worship. Did somebody holler? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm, I'm doing a video. Yeah, no problem. So I, who knows what that was about. But anyway, so um, where was I? Oh, I was talking about fuel economy and uh, electric cars. Mike Maloney, he's a guy, gold and silver report. Because, you know, I'm a gold, silver person. I, you know, I, I don't see how the dollar's going to survive when you're printing... Well, Biden's now going to print two trillion more, and that's that can't be a good idea. Um, you know, you can only print before the the, the dollar's worthless. You know, it's just a piece of paper, and uh, I I can't believe people are just going along with with all of that. And oh yeah, give me give me more uh, fake counterfeit money, whatever. You know, so uh, if you haven't got gold and silver, it's it's still pretty low right now. It just took a hit these last couple of weeks and uh, I'm not saying it's a good time to get in. The good time was you know, back in March, April 
uh, you know, when it was down in the teens, you know, silver's up about 24, 25 right now, fluctuating between that and 28. I haven't seen it go below 24 for quite some time. So those are, those are hard assets that you can get um, just, to, just as a backup. Uh, if the dollar does go crazy, it looks like we're heading towards what could be a digital currency, uh, which we're already there pretty much with the, the credit cards. And you know what, I'll, I'll just tie it off right there. I'm going to try to make a couple of these motorcycle videos when I'm done hiking. I'm getting rained on now, and it's not looking good for the, for the ride home. So, but uh, at least I'll sit here and enjoy a, I got a protein bar I'm going to dig into. I can't chew and talk at the same time, but I can drink a little water. Hey, you guys, uh, peace out, and, uh, you know, be good, be safe. How are we going? Hey, I forgot to get the one thing I wanted to say. So I got a lot of liberal friends that uh, I guess some of them weren't on parlor, and they don't understand what that means. I was rebuilding my business. I had 5,000 followers, and uh, and that was going to help me be a launching pad to redo my cybersecurity business, much like a lot of people use Twitter and uh, Facebook to, because uh, that was what I was told years ago, and I wasn't able to do is if you're not on social media, you're nobody, and nobody's going to buy your your product. And my product was books, and. Uh, so by taking Parlor down, they really crushed a lot of businesses that you know, may or they could be businesses they agree with or not. I mean, there were liberals on there too. It wasn't just the conservatives. And I'm getting really wet right now, <laughs> but I, I did want to add that before I, I signed off. All right, peace again. <laughs> Let's get that right side up. There we go. Well, what are we doing today? So obviously I got trapped in a storm here. It's one of the dangers of being on a motorcycle. So I, I mean, you, you could try to ride it, but all I got is goggles. And I can't bring my helmet big on it because I can't get the storage container for the back because this is a 2021 and they don't make it yet. You've heard me cry about that before. So uh, I don't even know which video I'll, I'll stick this in. Um, but I was, I was tired of color before I started getting super wet. And you know how that crushes people. You know, think about all the people that are up on Twitter right now who really depend on that for their livelihood. You know, without Twitter, they, their life is is meaningless almost. You know, because that's all the advertising product. That's all they they report on. Uh, you know, advances in their, in their technology and stuff. And so that was what Parler was all about. I and mean, there were 15 million people on there. I mean, no, is it 20 or 20, 15 or 25? I can't remember. And then just just. It was kind of like the, the, the Death Star when it came up, and here's Google, Amazon, and Apple, and they fired that boat down, and it destroyed the whole planet. <laughs> That's the only analogy. And then in Obi Wan Kenobi's there, though, we just silenced. You know, I heard a great disturbance in the force. There was 25 million just were silenced and spoken of a pen you know, by the by the big tech uh, crazies, you know. All right, well, hey, I just thought you'd get a kick out of me hibernating underneath the, <laughs> the sign here at the open uh, oh, look my Hawa, uh trail. So i got to wait this out. I'm going to be here about 40 minutes. i got my protein bar. This is why you come prepared. I even, I didn't want to show you the video. I even got a couple of beers and I threw under the seat just in case. But uh, sometimes, I'm, so I'm going to just chill out. Enjoy it. It's, uh, it's great being out here. I don't mind it. And, uh, I don't want to ride in the rain, but I don't have to. You guys have a good one. Peace out.